On a rainy night in 1986, a nurse from the US named Sandra Clark was checking in on one of her patients when she realized he was soon going to die. In a trembling voice, the frail old man faintly asked her if she could stay with him since he knew that his organs were failing and he didn't have long. And although Sandra said yes, she told him that she had to finish her rounds with the other patients but would be back as soon as she was done. 90 minutes later, Sandra finally finished and made her way back to the man's room. But she had been too late. To her shock, by the time she got there, he had already passed away. And recalling that the poor man had wanted nothing else but to not have to die alone, she knew she had failed him. Deeply saddened, she resolved to create a group of volunteers who could stay with deathbed patients who had no one else. Although her vision remained just an idea for 16 years, in 2001, Sandra founded the organization No One Dies Alone. Bringing together volunteers to rub patients' feet, read to them, or simply hold their hand, her program gives people who are homeless or simply alone the comfort they deserve at the end of their life. And since its inception, NOTA has inspired numerous similar programs around the world while helping thousands leave Earth feeling loved and cared about.